Open your heart to receive the revealing, transforming, and living word of God from the man of God, Apostle Paul M.E. The essence for which Jesus Christ came from heaven to earth is to give us life and that we might have this life in abundance. Remember he said to Thomas, I am the way, the truth, and the life. In John chapter 14. In John chapter 6, he said, These words I give to you, they are full of spirit and life. The flesh counts for nothing. So when we talk about our natural life and our natural birth, it is not enough for our Christian journey. The scripture says in John 1 verse 1, In the beginning was the word. The word as spelled W-O-R-D was with God. The word was God. Now the word became flesh and lived among men. So we are talking about the life. You see here, the word became flesh. This was a transformation. And lived so what manner of life is this what manner of life is this what manner of birth is this how can the word be born and it becomes into flesh what are you born of you need to ask yourself who are you in the flesh jesus was the word in the flesh now the word living and becoming a living reality that can act that can speak that can move that can think that can reason the word became a living reality a person with flesh with faculties and organs the word became a living reality of a person who could think of his years on earth remember our lord jesus lived from zero age from day one that he was born as a baby till the age of 33 now is the word coming into living in the form of flesh as any other person who can think of a future what did jesus think concerning his life and how did he think remember he said i am the way i am the truth i am the life there is no way these three can be separated the way the truth and the life if you have accepted the life you will accept the way because the life is the way if you have accepted the way you will accept the truth there is no way you can be a man or a woman of truth and you are not a man or a woman of the way there is no way it happens like that this exposes our life to hypocrisy and impostorship meaning we claim to be what we are not men don't know us as we are before god's eyes before god's eyes the way the truth and the life is examined it becomes a unity it becomes one the way the truth and the life what life are you having what are you born of the word became flesh the word was born and the word became flesh 
Now the word started operating in the flesh. Reasoning with faculties, with organs, with blood vessels. Jesus had blood in him. He had blood vessels. He had organs. But you will discover that as he was the way, the truth and the life, Satan could not dominate his life. And he was born of the word. The Bible says we are born of the word of God which is incorruptible. Our natural birth is corruptible. But when we are born of the word of God, we receive the incorruptible nature of God. That is the infallible nature of God. We reason as God, we think as God, we live as God. Christ Revival TV Supplying spiritual renewal to maintain a living faith